If cats have nine lives, Courage must have about a thousand. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 worst things that happened to Courage the Cowardly Dog. Can one of you boys give me a hand? Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. For this list, we're looking at the most disgusting, painful, and terrifying incidents to befall Courage the Cowardly Dog. Please note, a spoiler warning is now in effect. <laughs> Number 10. Having to lick a fungus foot. This episode really tests Courage's gag reflex. When Eustace contracts a foot fungus, rather than do the sensible thing and visit a doctor, the farmer concludes that a quick nap should fix the problem. Long story short, Eustace was wrong. <laughs> After consuming the irritable farmer's entire body and transforming into a disgusting gigantic purple foot, the fungus starts to boss Courage and Muriel around. You won't be needing your husband anymore, see? Eventually, the heroic dog learns that the only way to cure Eustace's itchy infection is to give the fungus a thorough licking. Is there nothing Courage won't do to protect Muriel? Number 9. Being Forgotten Living in the middle of nowhere and constantly under attack from all manner of weird creatures, Courage's life is loaded with hardship. Oh, what a nice couple. Who are they? As the only person who doesn't try to intentionally maim the timid canine, Muriel is Courage's one beacon of hope. I've never seen him before in my life. In the show's second episode, however, a blow to the head causes Muriel to come down with a bad case of amnesia and completely forget him. Doesn't remember who she is. Doesn't remember who I am. Need help. Send, send, send. Suddenly, Courage is truly alone. Eustace instantly throws the poor dog out of the house, and he gets back in, only to face a conniving con artist. When it rains, it pours. Number 8. Having to perform an exorcism on Muriel If Eustace and Muriel had any degree of common sense, most Courage the Cowardly Dog episodes would have ended after about a minute. Despite Courage's earnest warnings and the clearly shady delivery men, Muriel accepts a new mattress and ends up becoming possessed. Won't you join me? <laughs> when a thumb war with the demon fails to do the trick, Courage discovers an incantation that should help. Unfortunately, the exorcist has to wear a silly dress and spout a bizarre chant. Scaring the dog half to death is apparently not enough. Courage also has to be humiliated. Number 7. Getting chased by carnivorous vegetables It's the attack of the killer vegetables. When even food is out to get you, you know the universe is not on your side. With barely anything to eat, the Bag family call in an expert, who installs a greenhouse for veggies. Planted under our new Millennium Geodesic Environmental Dome. Sounds simple enough in theory, but there's one thing that the specialist forgets to mention. These particular vegetables happen to be the human and canine eating kind. <laughs> Be it cabbages, beans, or headphone-wearing tomatoes, all of them are hungry, and Courage seems like the ideal main course. Number 6. Suffering the Ridicule of the Perfectionist Compared to some of Courage's other antagonists, this intimidating schoolteacher might seem relatively normal. But don't be fooled. When Eustace's constant mockery causes Courage to obsess over his flaws, the dog accidentally summons the perfectionist. The turkey in Albuquerque is positively perky. Seeking to teach Courage how to be perfect, the teacher puts the poor animal through various hellish lessons and berates every tiny mistake. By the end, the hero is plagued by nightmares and starts to second-guess everything. Ah! That's not perfect! While the dog has been through deadlier encounters, the perfectionist wreaked havoc on Courage's psyche. Number 5. Being Shaved by Freaky Fred What brings you to our cozy corner of the world? Holiday. No barber should be this terrifying. 
Freaky Fred is among Courage the Cowardly Dog's most fondly remembered villains, although Muriel's nephew is not truly all that evil. D-O-G is what he spelled, and that's how I spell naughty. Unable to resist the urge to cut hair, Fred immediately fixates on Courage's purple coat, and psychotically begins to slowly strip the pup down to nothing. Eventually, Fred is taken away by the authorities, but Courage's tail is the only part that survives the ordeal with any fur. Hair might grow back, but Courage's memory of the undesired shave will probably last forever. Number 4. Enduring a Plague of Locusts At one point or another, every nightmarish insect has attempted to use Courage as a toothpick. Apparently, the dog just looks really appetizing. When a stolen Egyptian slab lands on the farm's doorstep, and Eustace refuses to return it, King Ramsay's ghost unleashes three plagues on the family. Return the slab, or suffer my curse. What's your offer? The first two curses prove no match for Eustace's stubbornness, but King Ramsay's final move is to unleash a horde of hungry locusts. <laughs> With the house already gone and used to still acting like a greedy idiot, Courage barely avoids being on the receiving end of some biblical level punishment. Number 3. Starring in a reality TV show Reality TV can be mean spirited, but certain lines should never be crossed. Benton Tarantella, a zombie serial killer who used to moonlight as a film director, turns Courage's everyday torment into a source of entertainment for the whole world to see. Oh, yes. The camera loves your nastiness. In the reality show, fueled by Eustace's appalling treatment of Muriel and Courage, the director pushes the farmer to progressively commit even more heinous acts with each passing episode. <laughs> While the dog is no stranger to dangerous situations, this marks the only time Courage's misery was broadcast to a wider audience. Oh, it's the stupid, ugly, losers! At least that he knew. Number 2. Playing in a dodgeball game against his enemies Bringing together six of the cartoon's most notorious villains, the episode Ball of Revenge sees the lovable mud facing near insurmountable odds. Determined to finally get revenge for every defeat endured at the hands of the cowardly dog, the villains kidnap Muriel and challenge Courage to a deadly game of dodgeball. On paper, the group's plan might sound kind of stupid, but the match is really an excuse to pelt Courage with balls. Once the onslaught is complete and the hero is rendered defenseless, the Despicable Six move in to extract their pounds of flesh. Luckily, Courage unleashes a devastating scream that turns the tables. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few dishonorable mentions. Number 1. Being Owned by Eustace Bag In a series packed with sadistic and horrifying villains, this obstinate old man is the lowest of the low. <laughs> After Courage's parents were abducted by a veterinarian, the puppy was adopted by Muriel, a decision that did not sit well with Eustace. Stupid dog, always bringing garbage into the house. Belittling Courage at every given opportunity, and not above getting physical, Eustace is an abusive owner who should be kept as far away from animals or humans as possible. I hate that dumb dog. Oh, don't you fret, Courage. He doesn't hate you. Regularly referring to Courage as a stupid dog, Eustace's arrogance and jealousy are to blame for most of the terrible things that happen throughout the show. Stupid dog! What are you doing? Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.